Cities and towns across the Commonwealth are getting ready for this winter weather. WBZ's Nick Giovanni has everything we need to know ahead of the first snowfall of the season. Counting down to snow time. There was salt aplenty piled high beside the pike in Weston Tuesday morning with plows on the move. Gearing up for the first flakes of the season to potentially fly tonight. It's a wicked bummer. I hate it. Some drivers wrestled with a range of emotions. Seeing snow back in the forecast, hours from potentially falling over parts of the state. It's time. It's time. Yeah, it's going to happen regardless. Is it really going to snow? Others trying to time out their commute accordingly to beat the wintry weather home. I'm not really ready for snow tonight. I'm hoping to get home before then. I don't like to drive in the snow. I'm probably going to be off. Yeah, it's too dangerous. One issue some communities are facing again, plow drivers or lack thereof. Towns like Walpole scrambling to get more crews on board. Their DPW director says ideally they need some 40 to 50 more pieces of equipment. And they've increased wages toward that end, adding a pay incentive even if it doesn't snow. In neighboring Norfolk, the public works director tells WBZ they have enough drivers to get by, but had this to say about the overall driver shortage. DPWs like here in Norfolk, we used to be able to train drivers in-house uh, to get them their CDL and uh, we can no longer do that. So that has certainly thinned out the amount of people out there uh, that we can employ for, uh, for snow plowing. As for the highways, MassDOT tells us they will have enough drivers on hand to do their job tonight. Reporting in Weston, Nick Giovanni, WBZ News. Mm -hmm.